Hello everyone, welcome back to my Final Fantasy VII playthrough. This is part 5. I'm Mr. J Place. If you remember in the last episode, we finished up our side quest. Got Tifa to decide to go on a, I guess, a date with Cloud. She's gonna wear something exotic, and now I have to find something exotic to wear. And that's where we left off. Uh, she did say we had to go back to the bar. Apparently Barrett's ready with our money. Now we finish all the side quests. What do you got, Yzma? Hey, Maro. We took care of the filters. So we're gonna head back to the bar now. Take care, you two. Oh, you're looking pretty chipper. What happened up there? Uh, I don't feel that different. Must be my imagination, then. <laughs> anyway, keep your wits about you, Merc. Thanks, Yzma. A token of my appreciation. Be good to her. Ooh, a crescent moon charm. Alright, just to double check, I don't think there's anything we have. Yeah. We've done all the side quests we can do right now. Alright. Oh, there was this. There's something that happened, something the train collapsed or something. I hope he's okay. Stay away from me! Hold it! Who are you? Settle down now. Get off me, assholes! I didn't do shit! How did they blindfold him? Funk. Or what, huh? Screw you! What's Come going on? on? You Somebody do me like went that? and stole some blast from you. a Shinra warehouse. <laughs> so public security started asking questions, and you know how Johnny gets. It's because of the reactor bombing, I bet. I could be wrong, but something tells me. They're not gonna settle for just roughing him up this time. We've got to save him, Cloud. Is he Avalanche? No. He doesn't really know what we do. But he has his suspicions. And... He's a talker. Oh, goody. Actually, you know what? Maybe I should go alone. I'm coming. Uh, are you sure? Oh, yeah. It's the least I can do. Lead on. <sighs> Thanks. Come on. Oh, let's go. Johnny's the weird dude, like the black okay. leather vest with the spiky hair in the original, who always like walk around all janky, like and kick stuff. What the hell, man? You trying to break my arm? Dragging me through the street like this. <laughs> I guess they decided to flush Johnny out a little bit more. Alright. Come on, let's get a closer look. Is there a way to treat a model citizen of Midgar? Model citizens don't steal blasting agent. So why don't you tell me why your ID popped when we were going over the warehouse logs? <laughs> huh? Got it all wrong. I've never gone anywhere near a Shinra warehouse. Did we frame him? Oh, Jesse, no. Your ID was never lost, my man. I never got you inside a cigarette installation in the first point. I tell you, we'll all the time you need to help me get the story I swear, all he had to do was keep his mouth shut. Yep. Anyway, you distract the officers and I'll figure something out. Okay. How are we on health? Do we need to sit down? We're good to keep going. No need to take a break yet. On that little bench. The little blue bench. Let him go. Oh, he's red. Who are you? The cavalry? Huh? Is, that, is that who I think it is? Oh, hell yeah! You guys really came to save me! Out on level! Bird! What do you think you're doing? Here we go. Damn, Johnny. Well, now we gotta kill him. Here we go. Nobody, nobody in real life would be that. That's that. Let's do I should really probably assess these guys. Let's do it right. Something leveled up. Guard dog. Military can't unstream by troopers from Shinra's public security division. They are extremely obedient when trained and can sniff out intruders and launch rush attacks when ordered. Oh, no, no. All set. Yeah. No, I, 
man. Give him your go. all. Gotcha. I missed again. Uh, so, is it over? Do we have to kill him now? Just uh, yeah. Like the butcher from what Skyrim. Now? Executioner. Huh? Whoa. Whoa! No! Whoa. You're not gonna hold up! Wait! Don't don't do it, man! You wanna live? Then get the hell out of town. <laughs> you, you got it, boss! You ain't never gonna see my face again! How can I he swear? see? <laughs> Are you sure about this? It's a big risk. I know, but it's fine. <clears throat> she dated him. And them? No more. No more? Didn't we just kill Cloud. them? You're scaring me. <clears throat> we need to go before they wake up. They're not... They're not breathing. No, Tifa, we, we killed them, honey. That's something the original never touched on. I mean, they kind of, you know, disappeared. I guess it's a good thing we're knocking them out. I, I'm worried about Johnny. Why? I'm more worried about us. We gotta go, right? Yeah. Right. Could get the hell out of Dodge. What? It's just, you've really changed. How? I suppose it's... Yeah. Your eyes. They used to be less... Glowy? It's the Mako. Soldier. Remember? I remember. Right. Back to the bar. Alright, Tifa. Can't get cold feet now. You hired me. Oh no, Cloud the Merc kills people. We can't have that. We can't have him killing people, even though we blew up in a reactor. Do I have to go check on Johnny? No, we just go to the bar. Oh my buddy, lift! Lift! Aw. And here we are. You must be tired. Same as you. I guess. Could use a little something to take the edge off, right? Milk. How about a refreshing cocktail made by yours truly that you can sit back and savor? Tifa. Yeah, I'm feeling it a bit too. Hey, do you think you'll stick around a little longer? You want me to? Maybe. Work for a minute, build up some savings. I see. So, what'll it be? Wanna head back out for a little while? No. We've already done everything. Oh, Barry. Did you have fun? <laughs> Lots of fun. Hey, oh. need y'all downstairs. Uh, right now? Then the plan is... Marlene, wanna go wait for Jesse out front? Okay. Marlene's cute. <laughs> she loves her daddy. Looks like we're officially on for tomorrow night then. Gotta go over the details with the others. Before you do, about my pay. You'll get your money. So sit down and shut up until we're finished. <laughs> Double time, Tifa. Volcano bombs, pinball. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, I'm really sorry, but it shouldn't take much longer. In the meantime, <laughs> grab a seat. Hey, the flower. What'll it be? I don't know. Something hard and bitter. <laughs> like my soul. <laughs> huh. Look, you try to be all fancy. <laughs> Sewer water! Coming right at you, sir. 
Well, nice. most people would say something sweet right about now. I'm sure they would. Another? Ah, uh, but you're a more discerning customer, aren't you? In which case... Let me just shake it a little more. How the hell is it red? Our house special, the Cosmo Canyon. Beautiful. <laughs> I gotta go. Uh, enjoy. This is just all gonna be vague flirting, is it? Spit it out. Hey, you see the news? The reactor bombing was the work of the eco-extremist group Avalanche. Public enemy number one. Gets your heart racing, doesn't it? They don't know our faces, so we're in the clear for now. But we'll want to capitalize on this momentum. Speaking of which, you coming on the next one? For the right price. <laughs> oh, you can bet I'll be pushing hard for a raise. Oh. <sighs> Tifa will be joining us too, but I don't know. Even a blind man can see her heart's not in it. She was never on board with the bombings, so if it comes down to do or die, if I've got to put my life in someone else's hands, then I'd rather that someone was a professional, like you. Oh. Could still kill some time. Look, the flowers in the vase. I mean, let's just do a quick, quick look, see. <gasps> Ooh, I can get behind the bar. The real deal, huh? What was up with that girl, anyway? Her name's Aerith, and she is a nice lady, Cloud. There's really nothing for me to do outside, so I mean, I guess we can go down. Apparently not. We'll change the music. Darts. Well, let's see how this goes. What? No! I didn't know he automatically threw! How is that bad? How is that bad? What is... Mm. I think I get it now. Round three. Oh, oh I'm way too soon. Boss. Damn near the perfect in the middle. Oops. I get it. 
I have to hit this perfect. Yeah. <laughs> like it's like got it. Oh, I did terrible. Maybe just chill a bit. No, we want to go. Go down. Yes. She's mad. What are you mad about? <laughs> Read the room. I heard you having second thoughts. I know we have to think big if we're going to make a difference. But not like this. I just... I feel trapped. If it feels wrong, don't do it. <sighs> it doesn't work like that, Cloud. Guess that's that then. What, they kick you out? We agreed to disagree. So, you want another drink? I've already had two in like Tifa, four time minutes. To celebrate. Break out all the good stuff. Oh, sure. <clears throat> we won't be needing you for this next job. Feel free to look for work elsewhere. Jesus. Fine by me. That's how I like it. No contract, no obligation. Figured you'd say that. Here, the rest of your payment, along with a little extra for your exemplary service. Oh. And thus concludes our business. Gonna have to ask you to leave now. This is a private affair. What the hell? Wait, what? Sorry, I tried. <clears throat> we talked it over, but in the end, we didn't want to put so much on you. This is our fight. Jesse, what's the holdup? <laughs> Be right there. No hard feelings, huh? Of course it's not. Fine. Not for you, Jesse. Let's talk more after I'm done here, okay? Really, it's fine. Come on, Jesse, I'm dying here. <laughs> I'll catch you later. <laughs> Sorry to keep you thirsty boys waiting. Oh, what? Don't call him that. Avalanche! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, fuck all y'all. That hit the spot. Damn, Biggs, slow down. <laughs> What's up with them? Who are you? Hey, brother. You from around the way? I guess. Uh, no big man with a big gun strapped to his right arm? Heard he set up shop somewhere in the neighborhood. That depends. Ah. <laughs> Clever. Smell an opportunity to make some scratch to you. 500. Really? 200. Mm, three. Whatever, man. Let's find somewhere quiet to talk. I like this music. Walk with me. <laughs> Definitely keeps the old feel from the original with a little bit extra going on. Hey, you got something to what? say? <gasps> you looking at me? Who are these guys? Hey. Move it! I'm I so said sorry. move! I'm trying to figure out what's on their shirt. Look at all these assholes staring at us. This shithole's got nothing on Wall Market. Am I right? Unless they're from Sector 6. 
Word of advice, Blondie, don't piss off my friend here. You'll be real sorry. I can Unless you got some kind of death wish, then be my guest. <laughs> oh, we're gonna stand in the shadow After corner, you, brother. And don't worry, I ain't the backstabbing type. Most I don't things. think you get a good shot. I mean, there's a big ass sword on my back. <clears throat> Spill it. You know where the bastard's hiding, don't you? I guess it's a I dragon. Told you before. That depends. <clears throat> Oh, yeah? You wasted my time! Shinra's time, you mean? <laughs> Shinra knows better than to stick its nose in my boss's business. Like I give a shit. <laughs> Can I analyze these guys? <laughs> so we're gonna focus on this guy. Sweet dreams now! <laughs> Holy crap, they can take a beat. Oh, ready. Allow me. Hoodlum. A man wearing a vest with a gaudy dragon emblem. He appears to be looking for something in the Sector 7 slums with his cohorts. And he's looking for Merrick. Alright, fine. You call for it. No, hold on back! Right away! General, then not my problem. Come on, Cloud. Lesson one for life on the ground floor. Get some rest. I mean, yeah, but at the same time, you did just beat up four dudes to protect Barrett. You could have just told him. So Cloud really does have a heart. He cares. Behind that tough soldier exterior is a soft, sweet Cloud. But apparently he's a sleepy boy, and we're going to bed. In Tifa's room? No. We're gonna shake our head at the door. Oh, Chessie. Oh, my, my. <laughs> Welcome home, honey. Oh, Took no. Took your sweet time. Uh, Psych. Uh, uh. That's about the expression I'd have. Uh, uh. <sighs> Are you gonna let me in so we can talk in private? Got a lot of girls in my room. <clears throat> Guess I'll get right to the point then. Materia, what have you got there? An apology for not getting you on the mission. Uh, uh. Or not? What do you think it is? It's pretty. A proposition. Nailed it in one. Gonna have to ask you to keep all this a secret from the others, though. It's a personal matter. Something I need to sort out tonight. Tonight? Trying to lose something there, Jesse? You and me, together. Oh, shit. Call I want it. you to come with me to the Sector 7 plate. I'll give you the details on the way. Oh. That's fine by me, but don't you have a pretty big day ahead of you? I do, but if I don't deal with this now, it's only going to get harder. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, it is. I can count on you, can't I? Hmm. Oh. A down payment. Hit for it. I like how the material is selling marbles. <laughs> Summoning materia. Summoning materia grants you the ability to call a powerful ally to your party's aid. A single summoning materia can be set to a weapon's materia slot. When facing a formidable enemy in battle, the entity slumbering within a set summoning 
When facing a formidable enemy in battle, the entity slumbering within a set summoning materia may begin to stir and the summon gauge will appear. Doubt we'll be back before morning, in case you were planning on traveling light. Make sure you've got everything you need before we leave. Oh no, I'm ready. You all set? Oh yeah. Awesome. Meet me at the station after dark. Don't be late. <clears throat> Wait, don't I have a date with Tifa tonight? <laughs> Jesse's so sweet. Don't you hurt it's her, Cloud. Just another job. You keep telling yourself that, buddy. You keep telling yourself that. Oh, what do we have here? Huh? Huh? Tough break. They changed the times. Last train's already left. Which is why we borrowed these bikes. Need a lift to the plate? How did you guess? Easy. You've been acting weird. Like talking about one thing when you're obviously thinking about something else. Yeah, and don't get me started on all that pep. All right, I'll give you that. But how did you know I wanted to head topside? Was I talking in my sleep? What else did I say? No, we just figured you wanted to see your parents, that's all. Nailed it, huh? Oh. Yep, right on the head. So, seeing as we don't have any family of our own, how about you let us be a part of yours for a bit? You know, spread the wealth. <sighs> Are your parents still around? Huh? Mm. No. Mm -hmm. <sighs> okay then, guess you're all invited. Here's to awkward family reunions. Yeah! <laughs> Jeez. Things of which are perfect for each other. <coughs> I take it you boys have your brand spanking new IDs? Yes, ma'am. Nice goggles. Then let's lay down some rubber. <laughs> Try that frog. Okay, you got it. Why do we already have the sword out? You hear me? Yeah. Just so you know, I'm not going plate side for the reason they think I am. Look, you saw the way the reactor went up. It was huge, right? Because of all the Mako. Isn't that what you said? Yeah. That was wishful thinking. Deep down, I know it was my fault. Mm. I used a more powerful blasting agent than the directions called for. It had nothing to do with the Mako. Let's say you're right. So what? I'm planning on using a weaker blasting agent this time. But, since I can't get in touch with my supplier, our only option is to loot a warehouse owned by Shinra. We just dealt with Shinra. it. With Johnny. Good luck with that. With your help, we won't need luck. Oh, 
Come on. Slow him down, Wedge. Damn it. Got him. Vince and Wedge totally hit that pillar. No way they're okay. More company! Eighteen's here. Uh, Whoop! We'll make the sound of that. We're not scrubbed, are we? Whoa. Ah. Heard that, huh? <laughs> My ears are 
I could ever grow tired of your company. Naughty, naughty! Until one of our flames is forever extinguished, our games will never rest! Fight for me! Yeah. Driving. Did more than just pass. Not really. You made it by the skin of your teeth, if we're being honest. Whatever. Ah, I bet you held back because I was with you. Didn't want you to fall. So now I'm too weak to stay on a bike? Huh? Huh? <sighs> just hold on tight, will you? <sighs> what? I might... Be falling after all. Jesse, too. Mm -hmm. Psych. Oh. <laughs> Jesse's cute. Oh. oh, would you look at that? It's the end of the ride. I know what they're doing with Jesse, and I don't like it. <sighs> but no spoilers. We'll go on foot from here. Don't want to draw too much attention to ourselves. You gonna ride the bikes up the stairs? 
Hey, did these things leave a mark? <laughs> they got you pretty good. Oh, and I'm running on fumes. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll top you up soon enough. Now let's roll. <laughs> Big says grenades and a barrel fed. I think it's a shotgun. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and pause or stop the episode there. So thank you for checking out episode 5 of my Final Fantasy VII Remake playthrough. Again, I'm Mr. J Plays. If you like what you see, consider giving me a thumbs up. If there's anything I missed uh, by skipping through some of that, uh, leave me a comment down below so hopefully I can go back and get it. And if you like what you see, consider subscribing to the channel as I am putting out more content. And I will see you in the next one.